guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting through to episode 19 of season 2 of the Misfit of Dean King Academy. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, oh we just, alright, we just continue right where we left off two weeks ago. God, that means we're gonna see the dragon again. Oh, God. Oh, God. See, gone within a couple of seconds. Yes, thank you. No. Aww. You sure about that? So a year later, older, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god! So, I mean, you, you, wanting to bring the lost memories together by sleeping with each other. Not actually sleeping, sleeping with each other. Right? Girl! Just cover his eyes. Okay, now here's the question. Are we going to find out who his parents were? in this, like, little teeny tiny arc that we have left before the show's over. <laughs> that, or we're gonna find out in, like, season three. Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, so she OP of OP. Okay, yeah, yeah, makes sense. I mean, should we summon her or something? Maybe she secretly just wanted to hide your memories and such until you were, like, of age, ready, strong enough. I mean, because, like, no, let's really talk about this. Everybody in this group is either a god or they were a hero. They all were reincarnated in some way, shape, or form, so... In a way, they all kind of knew each other as well. Not only that, but something else. Right. Okay. What if it's somebody close to y'all? True. It also makes me wonder, like, seriously, the many days that they possibly have to take off for Ish 
You're like, how the hell y'all still be passing class? Like, damn. But damn, hold up. Uh, uh, hell no. Hold on. Death is the key word. <laughs> We're not trying to be like the heroes who almost got killed a couple of weeks ago. Of course. Tomorrow! <sighs> Bruh. <laughs> okay. Once again, I can't let his voice act her and she's like, Okay, our inner thoughts and feelings about each other. <laughs> oh, damn.
<laughs> right? So there really is nothing else for you guys to do. Hmm? Are you serious? And these two? You're not gonna have them go against her dad, huh? <laughs> Bye, I'm trying not to fangirl right now. <laughs> Of course, a fucking course. <laughs> Dude, are we finally getting back sorry on Ash? I mean... I love how he's just like, yeah, I just invented it. <laughs> Babe, what? Uh, two RP. believe oh my god
en bob. It, it really has. Which is? Is that because, like, their color of their love is white and not pinkish? If you would have told me this episode, in a nutshell, would have been nothing but about defeating people with love, I probably would have looked at you like you were not. God, that's so pretty. You know, like that one moment from the first Infinity Nikki trailer, I'm definitely getting filled for that. Also, I'm just so excited for that game. <laughs> Once again, <laughs> you already know what the fuck I'm going to say. Do we need to see zero targets? <laughs> God. But no, okay. I, I love the training montage. I love the fact that, is, that Anos literally took students and literally dead ass is like, okay, you're going to go against yourself because your biggest criticism or criticizer is yourself. You're always going to criticize anything about yourself any little detail how I even still do that about myself till today sometimes it could be about my videos the way I look I, I, I do it a lot with the way I look because like I, I, I like the way I look I, I love how I just accentuated myself right there um but just like any other woman I do have flaws that I am like I don't really like that about myself and so <laughs> I I go really hard on myself especially so like okay for example um the one thing that I really truly hate about myself is my weight issue and such um pretty much any woman can also feel that same way and such and so throughout the week while I'm at work um Monday through Friday I only work three days a week and then I work on a Sunday of course um I will sometimes get asked by people or co-workers and such, um, asking like, oh, hey, why don't you go get anything to eat? Are you hungry? And such. And so sometimes I will literally not eat from the moment that I get up all the way until like four o'clock in the afternoon, hence the time that I got off of work. And I, when I get off at four o'clock, I am like extremely starving. Mind you one, because of course I haven't eaten anything since the day prior, and such um but two I'm also trying to save money because I'm trying not to spend money but now that I am <laughs> with my prime membership I can get this but still at the same time ordering on DoorDash, Uber Eats, um, Grubhub is now with prime and such as I said 
it gets to the point where it gets a little too expensive. And that's why sometimes, like, I try not to, like, always eat out while I'm at work and stuff. I'll try to, like, either bring something from home and such. But um, I remember one time I, this was, like, maybe high school me. And I, I was like, I had something small. And I remember one of my friends really compliment. No, mm, I wouldn't say complimented, but questioned. And that that's the biggest thing. Like, you're already going to be your biggest criticism or anything like that. Like, people always ask me, like, well, why did you just have a bottle of water? Like, that's going to have you help you for the whole day. Sometimes it didn't. Sometimes it didn't. You know, um, I was also accused of having it without having it. Um, and that was by a family member and such. And so having that conversation with them, that is extremely awkward because it's like, "Mm -mm, never done that. Please don't accuse me of doing that and stuff. You know me, you know, I would never do something like that. So don't ever accuse me of having it or and such. Um, and that really genuinely hurt my feelings. So now like with my relationship with food, I feel like it's kind of better with them at the same time. You know, you can have those days. Yes, but <laughs> yeah, I, I love the fact is it was just like, yeah, you need to face your biggest, you know, critique or which is yourself at the end of the day, because regardless, we all complain about ourselves at the end of the day, whether it's how we look, how we dress, um, how we present ourselves, how we do during a day or a week of work, anything, regardless, you are always our biggest toughest freaking critic and you know some of us we hate that for it but yeah if you would have told me this episode in a nutshell it would be facing yourself and facing the love dead ass would have looked at you being like what the hell is this episode also yes what the hell was this episode (laughs) i I mean in the end we found out that (laughs) you would think that a love between misa (laughs) And, like, would be the most powerful love, or even between Shin and his love interest. But no, you're telling me the most OP of OP love is that of <laughs> Shin and Anos. Like, okay. So, BL is a thing, guys. Let's go ahead with that with the show. I'm mad at it and such. Now, um,. Once again, we only have a few more weeks left with this show. Do I think we're going to have a good enough arc with this? I am still like, I don't fucking know. I really don't know. And so I have to question a lot of things, especially every single week. Because like I said, once again, we only have a few weeks left before we're done. So, yeah. I wonder how this truly is going to end for this season overall. Which, something also tells me, probably when we do get to the end of this, they're probably on on dead ass they're going to confirm season three and such with everything that is now transpiring and such and some other things i don't know we'll we'll talk about that later yeah something it would not like i it wouldn't even surprise me if season three gets confirmed by the end of this so we'll say that for now but other than that guys that is my reaction to towards episode 19 of season two oh now that's finally done damn that took forever um, of season two of the Misfit a Diga King Academy. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode 20 BTW. I am super sorry that I wasn't able to record this last night. Like I said, um, I was babysitting. Or really, dog sitting. And the dog that I am dog sitting plus with my own actual dog, she wants all the attention and such and so she needed all of my attention and if I try to do anything she cries and such and so she's been with us since Thursday so I'm just like girl yeah so thank god she's in the living room with my mom and my dog but yeah till then I will see you guys all next time bye